Okay, hello there everybody, this is Kelly and um, with Social Trade Media and LivingHuntington.com and I've got, I've been putting together this really cool case study on this new viral marketing campaign that we're going to start offering to the Main Street merchants um, in the Huntington, New York area and we're actually using Mr. Sausage, one of our uh, favorite clients or favorite merchants uh, on our daily deal site and what I did is I uh, became admin of their Facebook page back right around Christmas and really didn't do a whole lot with it but uh, I think as, as you've seen uh, one of the previous just uh, little snippets we started with about 480 fans now they're up to 551 fans but since I am admin I want to uh, go in here and show you something that we just started up uh, uh, today is the 16th already and it's currently this is incorrect. It's about 2 o'clock, close to 2 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, yes, I'm working a little late. But at any rate, if we look at these new likes right here. So, there, there's four to a section. So, we have four here within the last three hours. We have another four, so that's eight in the last three hours. We have another four, so that's 12 in the last uh, three hours. And then we have... 12, 13, 14, 15. Now keep some of these names in mind because what I'm going to show you here, it's uh, probably going to blow you away. So <clears throat> within this platform that, that we have, what we're able to do is create coupon offers or percentage off offers and be able to post them uh, within the Facebook page. So for example, what I want to do is I want to go in as myself and I'll go back up here and search for Mr. Sausage. Okay, so that I can show you what's happening. So what we've done on this is we've created a little post right here that's pinned to the top. 20% off fine Italian foods at Mr. Sausage. Free coupons, only 200 available. Click here. So... <clears throat> what happens is when people are driven to this page and if they're not fans we've got an opportunity to build up the fan base like I just showed you within the last um, eight hours 15 new fans or something of that nature and I'm sure that will double again tomorrow but if somebody clicks on this link here where that's going to take them is to the special offers this coupon right here so we're taking them in, into keeping them within Facebook so if I click on the special offers, what happens is it takes the person, and since we're targeting people that are fans of, of Mr. Sausage, keep that in mind as well as their friend, we're actually doing a hyper-local targeting. So people come here to the free coupon page, 20% off at Mr. Sausage in Huntington, no credit card required, um, claim this free offer, and of course, you know, we do some highlights as well as we tell people 20% off purchases over $25 you know, not valid on, on, on these certain things and cannot com be combined with other offers and we can put an expiration date. So what I've done is I've removed myself from the uh, this platform, but when you claim this free offer, there's a couple of things that's really cool that happens. So I just clicked on claim the free offer. We're just waiting for this to process. Um, what the system does, it's going to go pull the primary email that you already have with Facebook, or you can put in a different one. Okay, but I'm going to go ahead and save this. Okay. Once I click save, it's it's processing here. So now it's taking me to the actual coupon. And so what we have is 20% off and you know, some highlights and plus the restrictions. And you know, do not scan the QR code. We're telling the customers don't scan that because this is for the merchant. And so you can do the uh, download the PDF version and print it up and take it in, or you can have this image right here on your mobile device and go into Mr. Sausage. Well, now what happens? Well, since I claim that offer, let's go back into uh, Facebook. Something viral starts happening. So let's go back to my home page, or let's go to my home wall, my news feed. There's a difference between your home wall and your news feed. So this is my news feed. We have 2,000 plus friends. And if we scroll down here, may not have shown up yet. I'll go ahead and refresh this and see what happens. Okay, let's go to my home wall. 
But one of the things that happens is, boom, I just shared this nice little message or the system that said, hey, I just found this awesome deal at Mr. Sausage in, in, you know, in Huntington. Check this out. So when people go in here and they read that, well, what happens is they click on that, it takes them where? Back to the offer. Okay. Once again, they claim the free coupon. And I've already claimed it, so it's probably going to tell me, wait, I'm able to claim the deal. We're already on the waiting list, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So we're preventing the person from claiming it again. Meaning the person can only get this coupon once and, and one time only. And some other really cool stuff that happens is we have this dashboard that's in here. And there's certain things that we can look at. So currently for today, we, we can look at view logs. Okay. And this shows, of course, you see that I redeemed this coupon today on the 17th. Um, and then all the other people, and I can look up to, you know, however many I want to look up per page. But these are all the different people that claim the coupon. Now, remember when I was talking about those fans on Mr. Sausage? Let's take a look at this. This is pretty interesting. Get in here. Uh, let me get, get to another page to get there. But the, actually managed several different pages here <clears throat> and this what the stuff that I'm showing you is not even live to the public uh, we just happen to have some special uh, access by different marketing uh, programs and different groups that and different software programs we use but remember those fans those new fans let's kind of do some comparison okay let's uh I've kind of already looked to this but let's kind of guy Simone where would we go in here? Um, something that's even better. Okay, so we have this section here, and we can look at customers. Well, let's look at insight, and then I'm going to show you something that's really cool. Let's look at the insights. Okay, so yesterday there were 13 people that, that claimed it. So far, we've had two claim it today, um, and two. So what this is showing me, there's been 125 views of that offer. 18 have been redeemed or claimed. That's a pretty good conversion rate, 14%. And what this potential reach is, is that we're able to track all the different, everyone, since everybody's coming in from Facebook, we're able to say, okay, well, everyone has friends, right? Well, this is what happens. If I were to click on customers, which I'm not going to click on this because of privacy reasons, um, I went ahead and took a screenshot. And... What we're also doing is we're building an email list. We're building a database. These are all the people in here that actually claim that offer. I'm going to close this one out and open this one up. Okay, there we go. But these are all the people that actually claim this offer. Okay, and I, I scratched out the email address. Remember, remember that one? Guy Simone? Guy Simone? Oh, oh, oh. Guy Simone, okay, that person actually was not a fan prior to finding this offer. Once they found this offer, they liked it and they, and they became a fan. So, let's look at this. Bill Frolick, remember that person? Robert Kelly and Jay Edlin, or, El, or Eldon. Um, let's go back in here. I'm going to open this one up. Jay El, Eldon's right there. And we got Robert Kelly down here. Those are other people that just became fans today, but they weren't fans until they saw that offer that we're promoting and that's going viral out on Facebook. Pretty cool, huh? But yeah, and we can see that everyone's on a hyper-local level. They're pretty much in the Huntington, New York area, or they must commute to the area for these two people in Brooklyn. They must be familiar with Mr. Sausage and know how great their stuff is. But uh, we're collecting this data, and we can actually um, download this data and put it into, into a mail program if we wanted to all right and so this is what's going viral but I just wanted to do this first little um, case study snippet so that you could see that uh, the stuff is actually working oh as far as the, the potential reach right there what that means is if we look at uh, these customers what we have is we have these numbers here the 72 the 154 153 516 326 463 1100 these are the number of friends these people have on Facebook. So when they clicked and claimed on that offer, that's the potential marketing that we have. And so as as excuse me, as this goes viral, as this goes viral, this potential reach goes up. 
And so, for example, that's why on this particular offer, we've got the limitation set by view all coupons. And like I said, we're just testing this and we're getting some really good results. Um, redeem page, product details. Um, you know, we're, we're setting this at, at, at a limit of 200. Product details, offer details. This is, this is break it here. Offer details. See, we, we can set this for, we only want two, this to be redeemed 200 times. So once it's 200, it automatically shuts off and it tells people, you know, this, this, uh, this, off, uh, this offer has been fulfilled. So pretty cool stuff. And uh, like I said, Kelly Gerard's here. If uh, just stay tuned for the other parts of the case study as this moves along. Otherwise, have a great day. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Will come in as this virally goes out to friends news feeds of people who don't know that Mr. Sausage is on Facebook. It brings in um, new likes. So we have this Tracy, Julia, and five other people like they like the photo, but these new fans. There's four down to Brittany. Four more down to Megan. That's eight. Let's see. Four more down to Samantha is 12, and down to Devon is 13. Now, what's interesting is we can compare these new fans. Okay, if we go and see all Ryan Summers. But if we go and look at these fans, I want you to point out a couple of names. Uh, look at uh, Samantha Bergman there, uh, Frederick Gruder, Ira Altman. Guy Simone, Bill Froelich, Robert Kelly. So when we go into the back office, we can look at a couple things. 26 have redeemed it. Um, two of those people are you and I, of course, 15% redemption rate. And this 11922 is representative of all the friends. Everyone that's claimed it, this is the amount of friends in their networks that are potential reach because as that coupon goes viral, these 24 people that have redeemed it, it's getting presented to their newsfeed, not their homepage, the homepage and the newsfeed. But you can look at the customers. What's going on here? Of course, there you are. But uh, <clears throat> so here, of course, we have pictures, names, emails, the day they redeemed, how many friends they have in their networks, and where they're from, as long as that's being listed on, on Facebook uh, as public information. Everybody, Kelly here with this final case study video. Uh, just a couple weeks later from when we started, um, today is the 31st of January. I actually wanted to get this done back on the 29th, but um, we just got really busy. But if we remember from the first video, we started out on the 17th, even though we kind of tested it on the 15th, but on the 17th, we only had 551 targeted fans for Mr. Sausage in Huntington, New York. Now we have 676, so we've increased that targeted fan base by using this viral coupon offer by 125 targeted fans in the Huntington, New York area. And so let's go ahead and take a look at that post and let's see what type of engagement, which is really important. And with only five to 600 fans, this is pretty, this is pretty incredible. So people that were clicking on this, remember what happens is when you click on this and you redeem the coupon, um, what happens there is just kind of this other example of of another uh, business that I was testing this with is this Charles Barada he actually clipped on that or clicked on that particular coupon and redeemed it and since Charles and I are friends you can see my name right here Kelly Gerards and this is my home news feed not my wall but once he did that I went and opened up my home news feed and boom at the top of it or on my news feed rather it showed it, it kind of virally puts out hey I just found this awesome deal check it out and it shows it here as like likewise a picture here and so when anyone else goes and clicks on it it takes them back to the whole process so the engagement here 135 people liked this post all right 31 uh, more comments are here besides the four that the three that you see but or 31 more comments than what you see and that it's all positive stuff you know and of course people would engage on things etc cetera, etc cetera. so we know what it did to the Facebook page or what it can do for your Facebook page. 
Okay, increase the number of targeted fans that want to pay attention to your stuff. All right, and those fans, we want to make sure that we're doing stuff that actually brings new customers through your door. So let's take a look at what happened here. Total of 68 people redeemed it, minus two for myself and the actual rep of Mr. Sausage. But you can see back on the 15th is when we kind of tested it. We kind of launched it on the 16th. I did that first video on the 17th, right? But as it trickled along and more and more people redeemed the coupon because of their friend reach. Now remember on our customers, it's gonna show us how many friends everybody has, right? And this adds up. And so when we're looking at the friend reach or on the insight, this will continue to grow. So when we go and launch another coupon for this merchant, it's going to build up that potential fan base reach even more and so on and so on and so on, which is pretty cool. And you can view the logs, you know, we can see all the different people that actually enrolled or not enrolled, but redeemed the coupon. Okay. Um, we've got full insight, of, you know, of the redemptions. But that's pretty much it. What could this do for your business? If you're a Main Street business owner, and probably, you know, and not even in Huntington, New York, you're a house painting company. The concept here is with these pages, if you have a fan page and you want to get that engagement on there, let us help you. Let us see if you qualify for a free test. Let us see if you qualify for a free test. And you can reach me at Kelly at KellyGerards.com. That's K-E-L-L-Y-G-E-R-A-R-D-S dot com. And I am the marketing director for Social Tree Media and LivingHuntington.com. Otherwise, make it a great day.